hey spice buds how you all doing welcome back to our channel this is your girl spice denise and i'm here today with a video to show you guys how you can wash your expression braid guys these braids they are very nice to do your hairstyle but guys for those of you who don't know this braid right here this expression right here you can wash it before you extend it to your hair because um, when you use these braids sometimes um, where they are coming from you are surprised to see how dirty the place is so it's best to wash these before putting them in your hair so I'll be showing you today how I wash my expression because we don't need our scalp to be itching because these expression when you put them in your hair normally after three days you will start feeling some itchy 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 going on there so we don't want that so we are going to wash these extension before adding them to our hair okay guys so if you are interested to see how i wash my expression then keep on watching yes guys so i am just wetting the hair I'm making sure that it's fully wet. Now I'm adding my shampoo. And I'm just gonna slowly massage the shampoo onto the hair. I'm just swirling it around in the water and make sure that it's fully sodded. So I'm just getting rid of the sod because I'm going to wash it out and add the conditioner. So now I'm just washing out the sod from the hair. So now that the water is all gone, I'm going to add my conditioner onto the hair.
so I'm going to slowly massage the conditioner into the hair to let it have um, that soft touch like original because when you had the con this sh the shampoo it's a bit rough so the conditioner will soften it up and let it feel like it's never been washed the conditioner will definitely give it that moisture and softness so I'm just going to wash out the conditioner from the hair and get it all nice and clean so i'm going to wash it out thoroughly and make sure the water is lukewarm we don't want to use any hot water on this hair because the hair is not hot water friendly unless you finish with all your plaits and you decide to put it the hands in hot water but just make sure the water is almost really cold lukewarm I should say lukewarm look at that guys it's really clean and i'm very sure if you never used to wash your braids and you try this method i am sure your scalp would be feeling so happy because no more itchiness so there you have it guys nice and clean So you can hang it up on a hanger and let it drip dry. That's it guys. So guys, I am back and this is what it looks like. It's just a little bit loose, but guys, it is nice and clean. So my girl can get it to use in her hair. If you're on a rush to use your hair what you can do is just open a towel down on the bed and put it on the towel and then you can use the blow dry a couple of inches away and just blow it so it will dry but if you're not on a rush just hang it up on a hanger and hang it somewhere and let it drip dry but otherwise, if you're not on a rush, just hang it up because this is four hours later. And this is what the hair look like. It's all nice and clean, guys. So, you know, when I put this in my girl hair, she won't have any itchy on her scalp. So, yes, guys. So, this is it. I hope somebody learned something from this. 
and spice buds i want you to have a nice day and spice baba and if you are new here please remember to hit the subscribe button and turn on your post notification bell and you are welcome to my family have a nice day bye